Remove the lower connectors from the storage slots in the base and press the adjuster release button, pulling the strap to full length. Repeat the process with the second strap. Fully recline the child seat and place it rear facing on the vehicle seat, ensuring that the child seat base is in full contact with the vehicle seat. Firmly press the lower connectors onto the adjacent lower anchors. Push the child seat down while pulling the latch straps tight, ensuring that the straps are not twisted. Check to make sure the installation is secure. The child seat should not move more than one inch side to side or front to back near the belt path. If the child seat is not secure, repeat the installation process or use a different seating location. When properly installed in the rear facing position and the car is parked on a level surface, the back angle of the child seat should be at least 30 degrees from vertical for children and up to but not exceeding 45 degrees from vertical for infants who are unable to maintain head and neck control. Use the blue line as a guide to achieve the proper recline angle for rear-facing installations. The blue line will be parallel to the ground when the child seat angle is at the center of the angle range, 30 to 45 degrees. If necessary, the proper recline angle can be achieved by placing a pool noodle or rolled towel in the vehicle seat bite and reinstalling the child seat. Rear-facing installations can be improved by the use of the VersaTether. Please review the VersaTether section of the demonstration videos on our website for further instruction.